to get a look at a ThyssenKrupp Isis elevator that I don't think has ever been seen before. The stuff you see in this video, do not try. Before I get started, this should never be done without the proper training and clearances. I know what I'm doing and I have the proper clearances to do this, so do not attempt any of the activity you see in this video. I am not going to show anyone how to access a hoistway or pit. I'm just going to show behind the scenes of the elevator. This is for your enjoyment. The only place you should ever look at a hoistway or pit of an elevator is in this video, so do not attempt this. With that being said, I'm going to get the camera set up, and you're going to get to see a very unique look at a ThyssenKrupp Isis. We are on top of a ThyssenKrupp Isis elevator. It is very hot in here because this building is not air conditioned. We are going to get a detailed look of this elevator. Again, like I said, do not attempt this. These are the guide rollers right here. It's got two to one roping. Look at this, this is a plastic sheave. Look how thin these ropes are. These used to be Kevlar ropes, but they replaced them with steel ropes. Here is our car top station. This is where we're gonna be running the elevator from. Like I said, I am not out to show people how to do this, so I'm not going to actually show how to do it. I'm just out to show you an awesome look at this elevator. And we have a safety rail here, and you can see down the shaft. You can see there used to be old Monarch freight elevator in this shaft. So yeah, it's got two to one roping. We're gonna start off the tour by running up a little bit, and we're gonna look. Let me put the camera on the tripod, and we're gonna look at the uh, Focus. All right, I'm going to turn the screen toward me. My focus is running this elevator safely. I'm going to get over here. See, I'm in a safe place right here. I got my hard hat on. All right, we're going to set the run. We're going to pull, push for inspection. Make sure everything's in the clear. Up we go. This is as high as I feel. Oh, I can go a little higher. I don't want to go any higher than I can get out. See, it's hot in here. Right. This is as high as I feel comfortable going. Now we're going to get a look at some stuff up here. This right here is where the ropes are attached, I believe, for the counterweight. Yes, that's for the counterweight. There's another pulley, and as you can see, we have two to one roping here. And right here is your safety governor, which I believe those worked on several ISISs with Kevlar ropes. And this looks like your selector tape. So yeah, ready for a ride? Here we go. Now going down, we're just gonna watch over here and you can see the counterweight. So again, I'm in the clear here. Here we go down.
Now, in inspection speed, you're traveling at pretty much leveling speed. You should never ride a car top at full speed. I'm going to stop the car and we'll get a look at the counterweight. As you can see here is the counterweight. It doesn't have the rollers, it has these shoes it travels on. And like I said, it's got two to one roping. And again, it's got a composite sheave. It's got a guard on it here, which is good. So yeah, this is the counterweight. All right, here we go down. Make sure I'm in the clear here. Nothing touching anything. In the clear of the cables. So down we go. We're down here just about to pass the second floor. I'm going to stop the car because I don't want to hit the final limit switch. Set the stop. Now we'll get a look in the shaft here. This is a look up the Isis shaft right here. You can see the counter right up there. It's kind of like a cartridge. This is like self-supporting. So it was meant to be like a replacement for a hydraulic elevator. And as you look over the safety ledge, you can see down in the pit. So going up, we're going to set the camera on the tripod and look up. Actually, I don't even think I need the flashlight. I'll put it on dim. Actually, so we've got enough light from this so I can brighten it up and find out. Here we go up. Set my run.
All right, here we are up here. Now, my camera is gonna get a full speed ride. You never ride on a car top at full speed. I'm gonna run the car up and down with my camera on top at full speed, and it is hot here. So my camera's in the clear. Now I'm gonna get off the car, set the stop. Pull for normal. Now we're gonna exit the car. Car top. I gotta find it there, my keys are up there. Now, in the final part of this video, we are looking in the pit of the Isis. If you look down there, that is the motor. It's in the pit. Look at that. That's some type of computer over there in the pit. So, yeah, the, uh, like I said, this is a good elevator, but I personally would not want my motor in the pit because you know what's going to happen if this building floods? Your elevator is ruined. There's the governor. Well, anyway, I hope you enjoyed this detailed look at a ThyssenKrupp ISIS elevator. With that being said, that'll be it. Now it's still picture time.